this encouraging me to share this video for you right now because it's important for you to know that every experience you go through, it creates an avalanche effect in your life. And so one experience feeds another. One experience feeds another. Come back to the but channel, it, you guys. In this video, we will be discussing the avalanche effect. Now, in our lives, we go through so many experiences. Like right now, we are all experiencing the big shift that's taking place. And by understanding that we're going through a lot of experiences, it's important to stay connected to our consciousness, the universe. The universe within it is extremely connected to the universe without. As above, so below. As above, so below. So it is our responsibility to stay so tapped into consciousness, so tapped into source. The energy that we are feeling right now is strongly connected to the days and months to come. It is extremely meant for you to see this video. Divine timing is at play right now. It is your responsibility to understand that what you go through, you grow through. What you grow through, you literally attach yourself to the higher perspective of the situation. And I'm taking you to the higher perspective in all my videos because to stay low vibrational, to stay connected to the only the surface of things, keeps you connected to fear, anger, hurt pain it disconnects you from your own inner inner compassion it disconnects you from your own ability to stay connected to yourself in a compassionate way which is how we've been living our lives it shows up in our lives it shows up in our health it shows up in our words we speak it shows up in how we treat other people it shows itself clearly clear as day and so spirit is encouraging me to share this video for you right now because it's important for you to know that every experience you go through, it creates an avalanche effect in your life. And so one experience feeds another, one experience feeds another, but it's your, it's your decision and your choice, which is the best thing ever. We have choice. We have decision. So you can decide in every moment in your day to tackle the situation and experience in an entirely different way on their pursuit and in their pursuit of happiness in the pursuit of extreme gratitude in the pursuit of energy flowing your own energy flowing out to your experience and and also out to your environment in a healthy non-toxic way in a healthy high vibrational way which is a challenge. I get that. But right now, it's a stronger need to, to go inward. It's a stronger need to connect to your own ability to be compassionate, to be loving, to be stable emotionally. Because this eclipse is going to affect everyone's emotions. I feel it. I've been feeling it all day. I've been feeling it. I feel things. I feel planetary alignments so quick i've been feeling this energy for the last month well before we get to this moment right here so i've been tapping into the energy of being compassionate i've been tapping into the energy of being grateful i've been tapping into the energy of being balanced i have been tapping into the energy of feeling my angry moments sitting with my angry moments and understanding the higher meaning from the angry moment it's because to latch on to an experience that you can't change to latch on to an experience or to a feeling or to an emotion or to what someone has done to you that you can't change is truly not feeding your now moment. It's truly not feeding your futuristic experiences that you want to create and manifest from here and here. So going forward and in, in, in enduring this avalanche effect and allowing this effect to strengthen you internally, externally, in all the levels, right? On all the ends, spiritually, mainly spiritually. Because our avalanche, our avalanche effects that uh, that we allow into our life, that we allow to affect our life, because literally you are allowing things to affect you. 
you just don't know you are because you're unconscious. Sometimes you could be unconscious enough to be aware enough to know that this avalanche effect doesn't have to affect me in a, in a horrible, negative way. This avalanche effect can literally carry me from pillar to post, from scenario to scenario, to one screen of my life to the next screen of my life in a positive way, in a positive, healthy way. Now, living life is, is it can be easy for us or it can be difficult for us. It's only, it's all up to us. It's our choice. And so, decide every single day to allow your avalanche effect to boomerang you into every moment of your life from here, from a healthy space, from a consciously connected, high vibrational frequency space. For an example, this person did me this way, I could be angry, I could lash out, or I can allow that experience and that emotional experience to carry me to my next emotional experience in the same frequency, in the same low vibrational frequency. Making me feel like I don't, I can't, I won't, or I'm unable. All of that is connected to low vibrational feeling. Everything that makes you feel less than, those are low vibrational feelings. So you can allow those feelings to take up the space inside of your being. Or you can allow your own self to get out of your own way to allow those extra healthy emotions to take front and center in your life. I'm going to love this situation. I'm going to love the heck out of this situation. I'm going to love the heck out of this person, even if it's from a distance. Because you, you have to, boundaries is so vitally important. I'm going to love me so much to where me loving the situation for what it is and allowing myself to leave the situation if this is what the situation calls for. Without robbing yourself of any happy moment, without robbing yourself of any connectiveness to consciousness, to higher consciousness, to God, without robbing me of my experiences of knowing that God is leading the way. And that means you are so tapped in to higher consciousness, to a higher perspective, to a greater understanding of your own life, of your own inner life, which greatly feeds the external life. This is why I always say in every video, we are, are, we are the literal key to our life. We are the key to our life, period. Via the frequency, via the words, via the energy we hold inside of ourselves, via the way we treat ourselves, via the what, the what we think, via the, the thoughts that we think. Every aspect of our being, of our life, feeds our future. And so, the avalanche affects every experience that we have. That avalanche affects from your past, meaning every experience on top of every experience, on top of every experience, on top of every experience can literally cause the biggest boom ever or it can cause the most amazing awakening ever where you are so in tune with your heart, with your mind, with your body to the point to where you are out of the way. But instead, you and God it's literally having the dance of a lifetime, you in higher conscious, you in the energy of the higher being, which in you, which is connected to higher source, connected to God, whether it's Jesus, Allah, the Lord Krishna, Jehovah, whatever the name of your deity is that you praise and worship, you are a fractal of this energy, literally. Inside of every one of us, there is a light that resides. This light could be small or can be huge. It's your choice. Whatever energy you, you allow in you to win, is, that's the energy that's going to win. That's the energy that's going to take control of all your experiences. Whether good or bad. Whether good or bad. But ultimately, you... 
You are the key. You make the choice. You have the power to make powerful decisions in your life. Only you. Only you have that ability. Period. Period. So, allow all of your experiences in your life that you experienced from way back there, all of those experiences that lead up to that great big avalanche that could be ugly or could be beautiful. You choose. And thinking and doing, make sure the thoughts is in alignment with the actions. Make sure the feelings are in alignment with the thoughts. Make sure the connection to higher power is in alignment with the thoughts, the feelings, the words, and the emotions. That way, whatever you put out into the world, it will have a grand effect because it's coming from the healed version of you. Now, thank you for coming to my video. Each one teach one. And I'm doing this because I love y'all. Most importantly, because I love me. Have an amazing day, night, in the evening, whenever it is you see this video, and let no person, no experience steal your joy. I love you.